Welcome to the bigger number first. In this lesson I'm learning to count on from the larger number even when the smaller number is given first. Now you can see down here that I've got two piles of apples. I've got three apples plus another pile of nine apples and I want to work out how many apples have I got in total. Well to start with let's try solving this problem just by counting on from the smallest number. So if we've got three apples here this would be our fourth apple, fifth apple, sixth apple, seventh apple, eighth apple, ninth apple, tenth apple, eleventh apple and twelfth apple. So we know the answer to 3 plus 9 must be 12. But you can see we've had to do a lot of counting to get that answer. Now let's see what would happen if we counted on from the bigger number instead. So if we go down a little bit, this time I've changed them around. So here's my big pile of 9 and here's my pile of 3. So 9 and if we're counting on from that we'll have 10 11, 12. So you can see we got the same answer, we got 12 using both methods, but it was heaps quicker if we counted on from the bigger number. Let's try another question. Uh, this time I've got four counters over here and another 12 counters over here. I want to work out how many counters do I have in total. Well this time let's just try counting on from our biggest number. So over here we've got 12 which means this would be 13, 14, 15 and 16. So 4 plus 12 must equal 16. Now if we hadn't have changed this question around and counted on from the bigger number we would have had to count all of these counters here which means it would have taken a lot longer. So it was much better choosing to count on from this bigger number here. Now let's try an example without any materials. Um, this time I've got five counters and I want to add 13 more counters so I'm wondering how many will I have. Well just like we've done in the other examples we want to count on from the bigger number because we've worked out how much quicker that is. So 13 is going to be the bigger number and I need to count on 5 more. So, so starting at our biggest number which is 13 I'll have 14, 15, 16, underline that as well, 17 and 18. So 18 is our answer. And we can just check, did I count on five numbers? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, yes. So 5 plus 13 equals 18. Let's finish with a, a really big question. Uh, this time I've got uh, 3 tennis balls in one bag and in another bag I've got 62, so 62 more tennis balls. I want to work out how many I've got in total. Well if we started from our smaller number imagine how many times we'd have to count up. It would take forever wouldn't it? So instead we're going to count from our biggest number. So from 62 all I need to do is count up three numbers. So I'm starting at 62. So I'll have 63 it's my first number, 64 is my second number and 65 which is my third number. So 3 plus 62 equals 65. Well I hope you found this lesson helpful. For more lessons check out teachertools.co.nz